I'm going to show you my uh, Teletext music software that I've made. Um, it's a pretty weird software, but I think you'll uh, like it. So <clears throat> uh, let's activate <clears throat> like this. Remote Control Music Studio version 2.2. So it's not perfect. There's some uh, bugs and stuff, but uh, I think you'll uh, like it. <clears throat> So, um, here we have the screen where you put the notes and uh, decide which instrument should play which note and so on. I won't go into details, but so I can add notes here in the middle by pressing like this. So now you see this new note. I'll put another one up there in the, in the right corner. Yeah? Okay, another one. Yes. <clears throat> Yeah, so that's that's the notes and stuff. So I will uh, I will play it and you can see how it sounds. Right. So this is a, this is a loop that just plays the same four bars over and over. Um, there's some settings here at the bottom. You can, for example, change the tempo. Right, so you see now it's 93.94 BPM. Slow. Uh, but yeah, we'll change it back for now. Alright. Uh, another powerful feature of this software is uh, artificial intelligence. You have different uh, artificial intelligence modes that you can apply to the music. And then it will change and you don't really know how it's going to change. It will change at all. Nobody really knows. But uh, I found that the mode that is best is number 27. So let's see uh, yeah. that. So now the, the song will just loop, but it will maybe change the um, If you want to arrange the songs on your own, you go to this, uh, this arrangement screen. It's basically like a maze with different variables and stuff, so you can make very complex. But, uh, but we'll let the artificial intelligence do it. Um, so we'll go to the modulation screen. Because with this software you can, uh, you can feed stuff from the TV into the music software. Right? So uh, you have the source on the left, the target on the right. So for example, we can uh, we can feed the sound from one TV channel and the bass the bass drum sound with the sound from channel number four. So let's see. We set the instrument to the bass drum on the right. Uh, then we set the TV channel to number four. Uh, and then we also set how how big the, the piece of sound should be. So let's set it to 1,000. So now you can hear that the bass drum is replaced by audio from the uh, So let's uh, let's do this piece of sound. Make this loop shorter by increasing the bite chunk to 400. And let's make it even less. Uh, and let's try. Uh, Uh, I won't go through everything here, but we should also check out the subtitle rap. Because then, if there are subtitles on a TV channel, it will be rap. 
magnify uh, speech synthesis, like a uh, uh, rapid. So let's fix the settings for that. We set the TV title to number 6, because I know that there are subtitles that are going on. And we select the speech synthesis that will be in this technique. Number 8 is the bottom. By far the most important of any of his works are the initial lines of the old from his book music and real life from 1874. At the age of 70, in June 1861, Arthur O'Shaughnessy received the post of transcriber in the library of the British Museum. And that way is also statistics from NASA and the weather and soccer and so on. Uh, quite nice. So now you can see that the, the music has changed quite a lot. It's still the same four bars playing, but the artificial intelligence has changed. Uh, so we got lucky today. Um, but we can, we can change the music even more in the performance. So this is a bit hard to explain, so I will just show you how it works. Okay. We are the music makers and we are the dreamers of dreams. Wandering by lone sea breakers and sitting by the slip streams. And dash world losers and world forsakers. On whom the pale moon leaves. Yet we are the movers and shakers of the world forever. It and uh, when you want to uh, when you want to save the music, you you can print it. So uh, I have this uh, special TV with a teletext print, so I will show you how that works. Let's go back to... Let's, let's print this, yeah? It's a bit broken the display here, so there's some empty lines and stuff, but that doesn't matter. Everybody's happy. So I press the print. Pretty good. Yeah, check it out. Yeah, so then you just print the rest and you have your song. Easy peasy. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye bye.